What is up guys, it is Colt from The Tech Reviewer. Today I'm going to share my experience using the Herman Miller Embody office chair. I ended up making the switch to the Embody in early 2013 and I was coming from a generic $150 chair that I had picked up from my local staples a, p a few years prior. So the configuration that I ended up purchasing ran me around $1,229 and included the Rhythm Black upholstery, standard carpet casters, and a graphite frame arms and base. The Embody's modern appeal had immediately caught my eye and it harnessed several design elements that set it apart from your typical boring office chair. Starting from the bottom, there's a five star base like many traditional chairs, but it is notably robust and its heavy weight helps to provide the chair with exceptional stability. And this means it's incredibly difficult to tip this chair over accidentally. The seat itself has a unique ergonomic design with a rigid piece in the back that acts as a backbone and a smaller flexible components that are connected together to provide maximum versatility and comfort. A closely woven fabric lays over these connected components and is soft to the touch, breathable, and hasn't caused any irritation for me even after extended periods of direct contact to the material. In my opinion, the Embody's build quality almost matches its premium price point, although I do see some minor wear developing within the seat fabric and the padding found on the arms. The base and body model doesn't include the adjustable arms, but I'd highly recommend dishing out the extra $100 as the flexibility of these arms are well worth the price. Not only can you adjust their height, but you can also choose how close the arms sit to your body within a 6 inch span. Adjustability is one of the Embody's strong points, and it makes a chair highly versatile to different body types as well as different user needs. Besides the adjustable arms, you can tweak the height of the chair, the length of the seat, the allowed tilt amount, and the tension of the tilt. On any given week, I likely spend around 50 hours at my desk working, and this type of thing was really starting to take a toll on my body. I ended up having a lot of pain in my butt, back, and thighs just from sitting all the time. Since switching to the Embody, I can literally sit all day without experiencing any pain. The closest way I can put it is that I feel like I'm sitting on air. I no longer feel the unnecessary pressure when sitting and the seat conforms to my body even after I rearrange my sitting position. When it comes down to it, the Embody is a wildly expensive office chair. But when you take into consideration the superior design, versatility, build quality, and a 12 year warranty, the Embody is a worthwhile investment for someone who cares about their comfort and long term health. Having used both the Herman Miller Aeron model and the Embody, I'd choose the Embody every time. It has been a great addition to my workspace and I don't regret spending a large amount of money at all. It's definitely a circumstance where you get what you pay for. If you are seriously considering purchasing an Embody, I would definitely recommend you spend the extra money and start reaping the benefits. What is up guys, it is Colt from The Tech Reviewer. Today, I'm going to share my experience using the Herman Miller Embody office chair. I ended up making the switch to the Embody in early 2013, and I was coming from a generic $150 chair that I had picked up from my local staples a few years prior. 